What's going on, dope shit gang? It's your boy Donna Bradley back with y'all another video, and today we've got Evil Morty rap remastered, not like Joshua, Tyler Clark, and Hollis CG. Yo, funny story about this. Okay, about this particular track. Um, I had his original, the original Evil Morty track. I saw the one that actually had him in it as he was doing it. I saw that way before I ever got into reactions. It was just something that I, I saw on YouTube and I freaking loved it. I, I listened to it quite a bit. Um, <laughs> but I never actually dived into the artist that was none like Joshua at the time, just because like well, I, like I didn't have time to dive into the music the way I wanted to, so I just had like some songs that I liked. Um, and then later on I had seen that like going through his channel after I've reacted, after I started reacting, I was like, oh shit, that was him. <laughs> <laughs> so this is actually really dope. I'm really excited about this. Uh, from what I remember, I don't think Hala was in the other one. I don't. I don't. I don't think I heard her in the other one. I don't know. I don't know. But man, we here, man. I want to see how they got it going on here. Because Tyler Clark do amazing things, and Hala do amazing things, and LJD amazing. Everybody do amazing things. Be sure to like. Be sure to subscribe. Follow me on all that social media. We hear that any further though. Three, two, one, click. Oh, I didn't even think about how the video was about to be different. Yo, 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 duh. Um, uh, hold on, hold on. Who's on the vid? Who's on the vid? Who's on the vid? Throw a like, of course. Well, who on the video? Oh, remix by Tyler Okay, Rick and Morty video. Ah, E M M E M M. Okay, all right. Let's go. So I had to look at some more of these. All right, cool, cool. Let's move. Yes, yes. God damn it. Yes. Great. Good. Seems like a good time for a drink and a cold, calculated speech with sinister overtones. A speech about politics, about order, brotherhood, power. Yeah, this is like I don't, I don't remember. It. Ah, I should have listened to it before this, but like this does sound like cleaner though. Now is the time for action. Hey. I'll tell you my darkest of whimsical story. Don't ever call me a typical Morty. I answer to nobody, Ricker with authority. Smart hey. to fall, sick of my wording, cause when I was Bro, I'm sorry, cause when I heard the end of this shit in the thing, I was like, yo, I don't know why that sounds so sick. And like, ah, the, the, when they put like the, the the beat behind it and I heard that shit, I was like, oh, that's a rap for me, bro. Never call me a typical <laughs> I answered to nobody, record with authority. Smartest of all, sick of my wording. Cause when I was born, that pricker tried forming me into a genius. I wanted more to see. There was no Jerry, no insecurity, no but the summer. Family quarreling, I excelled. Rick was ashamed and left for a Morty without any brains. See, alright. See, I like, I like, and I also like getting actually like into more than just like the sound of it, which I still think is amazing. Um, speaking on Evil Morty about like. He said he ain't have the family squabbles. He ain't have that. So, like, he excelled. He was smart. He knew what he had to do. And he said that, basically talking about, like, that Rick felt threatened by that and went to go find an idiot. Is how it seems. Um, yo, I, I, don't, I don't know the lore behind Evil Morty. Like, I don't know what, what, what they actually have going on with that character. But the way that none, like, um, explains him throughout this track, I think is dope. No, but the summer family quarreling, I excelled. Rick was ashamed. This and video was dope. Any brains, Cause he never heard me say, Oh, jeez, Rick, Rick, please just stay. Yeah, nah, this sound, this sound way better. Like, <laughs> I already love the track, but I can, I can definitely hear the differences. Like, uh, I thought it'd be harder, but there are some things I can't. Like, I said, please stay. Like the way that, like the way that it, this sounds is a lot more. I don't know, it's tighter. You know what I'm saying? It's the best way I can explain it. Let's go. Cause he never heard me say, oh, geez, Rick, please just stay. So I created my own and placed him under control. My right eye up on the goal. Did I mention ending bricks of all dimensions? Then I get their Mortys. Tortured them from night to morning to disguise my fort on hide our planet. See, like, he's just, like, he just kind of going over it. Like, he's like... He goes into the character, and then it's about, like, what this guy is doing. Like, yeah, he had them kids fucked up, bro. He had all the Mortys just plastered out all over the outside of the walls. Just with shit poking at their sides. Like, I was, I saw that. I said, ooh, made me want to hold myself. But, yeah, bro, that, it was it was different. It was different. I get their Mortys, tortured them from night to morning to disguise my fort on hide our planet and plan to plant the evidence on C-137. He prevented it. I'll avenge again. That's president. president. No, it's not. not. Rick and Morty is the Rick is Morty hiding in the Rick is Morty. Uh, Rick and the... Rick and ah, I love how he... I tried to get it. I love how he said that. That's like my favorite part of this whole track. It's the Rick is Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty's never Rick and Morty. Come on, bro. Hold on, hold on. Not 
rookie Morty. It's not rookie Morty, as in like I ain't one of these little bitch ass niggas back in here doing what you say, bro. I'm out here, dog. Let's go. But all right, it's not it's rookie Morty. Morty. It's the Rickless Morty the hiding in the Rickless Mortys because he killed those Ricks and he took them to you know do the, the damn woodpecker shit on their sides. But I'm like, <laughs> just the way he put that together was sick. But he's never Rick and Morty. Rick hey, and Morty, no, it's not Rookie Morty. If you're this far in the video and you're not subscribed. What the fuck? It's the Rick is Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty's never. It's evil oh, Morty. It's evil Morty. There we go. The Citadel's problem is the Ricks and Mortys feeding on the. See, this is. Is this new? I don't see that source of something, something I may not, because I, I feel like this is new. But I will see. Okay. Citadel's death. But I've got a message for them. From the Ricks and Mortys keeping it alive. A message. From the Ricks and Mortys that believe in this Citadel to the Ricks and Mortys that don't, you're outnumbered. Hey. Made my way to the Citadel to prepare to arrange that day when I sit up there. Campaign uh. for a change, though, win a fair. I persuade the state, but I didn't care. Hey. No fame by the fake news as a joke. Jerk and Rick don't know how I go for the throws when I'm pouring in both the more I coast and my manager getting cut short. Tried assassinating yeah, my, my manager getting cut short. Like, he just, he literally, he's just explaining, like, the, what, 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 ha what happened in the episodes as from the vantage point of evil morty but doing it in like dope ass musical fashion and lyrical fat you know what i'm saying let's go let's go let's go let's go fair and persuade the state but i didn't care hey the fame by the fake news as a joke jerk and rick don't know how i go and i thought it was a joke because it was an actual morty trying to run for president because it was like you know morty but morty was considered like a secondhand citizen at the citadel and he was like yeah nah fuck all that but like let's go i persuade the state but i didn't care the fame by the fake news as a joke jerk and rick don't know how i go for the throats when i'm pouring in both the more i coast and my manager getting Chainsaw didn't know I was going for the throats when I'm pulling in votes. Come on. Short, tried assassinating my ass. Cast him out to space with the trash. Hey! Cast him <laughs> Tried to, yeah, the, the, when, his, uh, when uh, the, his campaign manager tried to kill him. He, yeah, he got sent into outer space. That's a really fucked area. Like, uh, this is just, uh, yo, you fuck up here? Yeah, bye. Let's go. Getting cut short, tried assassinating my ass. Cast him out to space with the trash. Then the shadow council collapsed. I eradicated this clash. Now hey. I'll lace all my loose ends. Cause the change is soon to begin. No more slaves to break perception. Liberate the Mortys and win. So you know what can happen if you call me yellow shirt. Quilling any terror Rick upset about the work. Hey. Cause he never cared about how he let him hurt. Anyone opposing me is perilous to purge. No hey. partners in. Anyone opposing me is perilously purged. Come Come on, bro. I love the way that he puts this lyrically. You know what I'm saying? The it's it's because you have narrative raps that can just be a little bland. They're just kind of going over the character, doing this, 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 and that. But there's no real artistic value. You know what I mean? But this got the instrumental to be the sick, and it's how he delivers it, how he puts the words together to tell you something that is can more or less be explained simply. Like I love it. I love it. Let's go. But the work. They never cared about how we let him hurt. Yeah, when opposed to me, it's terrorist and purge. No more partners in curriculum. Start from dirt, like in the slums of Morty Town. For Rick and Suggs, like me, now see what I've become. No, it's not Rookie Morty. Morty. It's the Rickest Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty. He's never Rick and Morty. Hey, Morty. No, it's not Rookie Morty. It's the Rickest Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty. It's evil Morty. No, it's not Rookie Morty. It's the Rickest Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty. He's never Rick and Morty. No, it's not Rookie Morty. It's the Rickest Morty hiding in the Rickless Morty. It's evil Morty. Hey. Starring none like Joshua, Tyler Clark, and Dart Tavern. Wait, 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 you said holla? You said holla? Was she the one like in the background doing the ha? Or, or did she work on... Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Where we got holla at? What holla doing? What holla doing on here? Is she in the background? Ah, there it is, backing vocal. She was the ha, but still, yo, 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 yo. That was dope. We listen to Dope shit here. I love that song. I really do. I really do. I love the way that uh, it has been remastered. I think it's done very, very well. So that might have been her that I heard in the background of the last one. So there's that. Um, but this was this 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 track is dope. Like for me, it got a little. It was like all nostalgic, but it was still like just sick to hear. Um, it did sound a lot cleaner for the the parts that I I got. Uh, for like the parts like I, I could notice I can notice like I honestly I should have re-listened to the other one before I listened to this one just to have a clear point of reference but honestly like I saw this one and I got excited so <laughs> that's what just happened but this was dope man that's the take on it be sure to like be sure to subscribe follow me on all that there social media and I catch y'all next one fam peace